Hello and welcome back to some more Genshin Impact. So I'm over here by Cloud Retainer. Before I actually go over to her, uh, there are a couple things I want to point out. First of all, I decided to level up the characters that I have. Uh, now the minimum level that everyone has is level 40. And I can start claiming some of the, the prizes here too. Like, for example, that right there. Uh, for her. Uh... Where is it? A blade embraces its duty, as a jeweler cherishes their gems. And then this one right here. And then this one. And here we go. She's. I can claim two things from her. And that's because I was able to get her to level 60 from one, I think. I, I think she was at level 1 before. That or she was at like level 20. Okay, and the only other one that I can do that with is Bennett, who I leveled up the most. Ow. Where did that come from? Uh, he managed to go from level 1 to level 70. Because I happen to have the materials to do it. And I also got Venti to level 90. Which, uh, you know, is one of my main goals anyways. So yeah, there we go. Unfortunately, I ran out of the, uh, the books that you use to level up characters, um, in the process, but it's fine. Another thing I want to do is I want to claim the rewards. I now have the Luxurious Sea Lord, which is nice. I can claim that, 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 and that. I'm not sure what the Emperor's Balsama is. Uh, I think I... Oh, this is for... We're finding the luxurious sea lord. Okay, so I got one of those. Um, I'm assuming that they give you a total of five of those, so I should uh, pay attention to that. And then uh, there we go. I've I've claimed all the rewards for those. Another thing I did was I made the food for the challenges. So now I can get the buffs uh, for these, as well as the prizes that they give you, the books. This is the kind of book I'm talking about. As you can see, it says I own zero now of the Hero's Wit, um, which is unfortunate, but it's no big deal. I can always build up those pretty fast through quests and stuff in the future. I normally don't care about them, but I figured, uh, well, that's probably why I didn't have a problem using them all up. I haven't really been collecting them intentionally for a long time. Pretty much every single one that you see, or uh, every one I had, which was like over a thousand of them, was uh, a result of making them from quests and timed events and stuff like that. So the rest of the points I get for Festive Fever, because now I have 750 out of 1,000, are going to come from the uh, the, the trial of del or trailer de delicacies or whatever, as well as the Moon Chase Tales. Guess we can rest um, a bit. I'm pretty sure that this quest right here, Cloud Retainer's quest, will give me something with regards to that. The ash of trees stand tall amid the snowy scene. The land is lonely and tranquil. Verily, does one's third dish suit this atmosphere? What kind of dish are you going to make this time? Well, have you ever heard of uh, heard tell of a method known as braising? This technique did one discover upon reading through some culinary tomes. A fancy di did one take to it, and thus created a new recipe, braised meat with its color, culinary technique as its heart, okay? Now, this dish is hardly too tall a task for one supreme cuisine machine, but meat is key to this dish, and none but the best shall have one, or shall one have, whatever. Thus did one activate a mechanism and pursue the scent of fine ingredients to this place. The snow and wind drive hard here, and makes for slow work. One is aware, traveler, of your wealth of adventuring experience. Surely, then, a mere snowy mountain will prove no obstacle to you. One thus requests that you go 
forthwith and retrieve some ingredients once more. Uh, I'd like to have the recipe for this third dish, too. Your aid shall not be forgotten, for the completion of this errand shall one await you here. Hmm, the mechanism has come to a halt. Tis, uh, tis must be a, the biting cold, okay. Allow one to restart it. Supreme Cuisine Machine, activate. This should resolve the issue. Now then, traveler, pursue the scent one has put out, uh, put you on and retrieve those ingredients, okay? I'm still not used to the way she talks. Uh, I'm gonna check something out very fast for uh, that weapon, that claymore I just got, the what's essentially the joke we a weapon. Increases elemental burst damage by 12%. When elemental burst uh, hits opponents, there's a 100% chance of summoning a gi uh, uh, titanic tuna that charges and deals 100% attack as AoE damage. Oh, that's pretty nice. Um, let me see what, what, what it'll do when I uh, start refining it. So that uh, the next rank increases the uh, initial burst damage by uh, from 12 to 15. And the Titanic Tuna will deal 125% damage, which is cool. And I can do that one more time. Uh, so, and now it goes from 15 to 18% burst damage and 155 percent uh, uh, to 150% for the Tuna damage. A very interesting little... Uh, little thing there. I'll probably test that out later on, but for now, I'm going to leave it alone. Okay, so it wants me to follow this path to where I need to go, which is all the way over here. At least this path is a little bit easier to follow than some of them. Okay, I had to stop there for just a second because I wasn't sure uh, if I, if it had gone off to the right or not. And so far, it's going up here. Okay, I better stop by this little machine here to warm up. Well, although I wasn't that cold, but it doesn't mean that I shouldn't take a chance. I'll destroy one of these and like that to be able to stay warm. The aura trail leads here. Why is this aura trail so messy? Probably because of the cold. Uh, huh, so there's a huge snorboard behind this door. So that's where this aura is coming from. I couldn't read the rest of what Paimon was saying, but it doesn't matter. I can't uh, do that, so... Maybe if I find a way to open up this door. Ah, oh, this place suddenly lit up. Did you step on it? Yes, I did. So, there's another one, probably. And there should be two more. According to the little grayed out symbols there. Where's another one? There we go. And I'm assuming that the other one can't be too far away. Finally. Uh... What just happened? Maybe you need to light them up in the order that they appear. Okay, yeah, that's the third. Okay, so that's the second, and then the other one's the last. That's what it is. One. Two. Three. And then finally four. Good three. 
I'm dumb. Uh, who knows how the deep snowboard got in there. All that matters is I've got a way to get through now. Finally. Okay. Oh. Thankfully, I've got somebody like Venti. Collect these, uh... Here. Oh, I I guess I got the uh, meat I needed, but I'm still gonna collect this stuff. Okay, go back over to here. How goes your search? Secured the ingredients one desires, have you? Uh, yes I have. There you go. Hmm, what matter of morsel is this? They call it chilled meat. Chilled meat. An apt name indeed. It is of fair quality too. Still, we we shall need a small fire to thaw it out. Fortunately, defrosting counts among the Supreme Cuisine Machine's functions. Uh, it sure seems to have no shortage of functions, huh? Ah, false, uh, falsehoods. This device does not lack for missing functions. The ability to automatically gather ingredients from one, or automatic heat control, for that matter, one could go on. Many improvements still one must make to, to it in the coming days. We shall cease the idle talk here. The ingredients are prepared. One shall activate this device immediately. The heat control shall still be left in your hands, traveler. One would have you report your readiness once you are sufficiently prepared. Okay. Are you fully prepared, Traveler? Yep, I'm ready. Then, let us begin. Supreme Cuisine Machine, activate. I am expecting this one to be even more of a pain in the butt. Uh, I think that the middle one probably needs it the most. Yeah, unfortunately the middle one does. Now the left one does. Good grief, the one on the far right is also getting kind of dangerous, too. Here we Stupid. go! There we go. They really want to make sure that you... That you... Struggle with this, don't they? I wonder if there's a way... There we go. Did that work? Holy crap, it works! Aha! You stupid enemies gave me that idea. No! Dang it. Dang it. Come on. Go over to it. Oh! This right here caused the problem. Okay, I need to have... I, I need to adjust my party. Because... I need to add in an archer who can use fire. So, Amber, where are you? There you are. And then an archer who can use water, or a character in general that can use water. But I think... In this case, I want an archer. Do I have an archer I can use water? I don't think I do. Okay, then I'll use, uh... Wish me luck! Then I'll use Barbara. A little bit less precise, but it's fine. Uh, so I'm gonna have this torch lit first. Uh, with him. And then that torch I'll keep lit with, uh... Where? Wait a second. Oh, there she is. Uh, that torch is going to be kept lit, but I'm going to have to put it out pretty fast. Uh, Keep going. Okay. There we go. Oh, I don't know why, but I guess that torch doesn't matter, does it? Ha! 
How about you guys? Stop that. I thought that these torches actually, uh, help, but they don't. last another uh, 30 seconds essentially but once I figured out that you could actually use your character's attacks it became a lot easier okay may as well do that keep that one up a little bit new no. stop that May as well keep this one up too. Whew, there we go. I finally finished it. It smells great. It's a, it's a success for sure. Uh, I may as well grab that. Wow, that's that was uh, only mildly stressful. I may as well. I, I didn't even use them. I mean, I was gonna use Amber, but I uh, I never did actually use her for what I intended to use it for. Give me a moment to compose myself. Um, where is she? There she is. The threads of your fate lie in my hand. Okay, Cloud Retainer. Well, is the braised meat complete? Yes, it is. Here you go. I can finally be done with that. Hmm, a most wondrous flavor. One would have expected no less. Uh, of your supreme cuisine machine? Tis so. The completion of these three dishes have proven the reliability of one supreme cuisine machine. We have but, one, uh, but to solve the two issues of heat control and the automatic retrieval of ingredients, and this machine shall truly have achieved all-in-one cooking. Ah yes, lest one forgets your braised meat recipe. With but one difference, this recipe involves the use of normal raw meat instead. One deems that it must, uh, might be inconvenient for you to scale this frigid each time you wish to eat this meal. Ordinary meat shall serve in, in ordinary occasions. Okay. Uh, regardless, you have one's thanks for your aid in foraging for ingredients. To one's abode, one must now return and make further improvements to this device. Let us part here, then. One shall require any further succor. Uh, should one require any further sucker, please, one shall call upon you again. Okay. I'm getting cold. A measure of faith one has that you shall not decline should this uh, should that time come. Most highly does one regard your abilities and trustworthiness, after all. Okay, I'm starting to... Okay, there we go. Um, let me see. I'll memorize that recipe very fast. Where is it? Is it here? Yeah. I've got some of these quaint fates as well as uh, intertwined fates and quite a few Prima gems, but I'm not going to make any wishes just yet. What's up with this? Oh, it's just to let you know about the details. Okay. Um, now, the next thing I want to do... Let me look at this very fast. Okay, those three are completed. This, I don't think... Yeah, you need 1,000 Test of Fever to do the next part of that. Uh, so... I know where the next challenge is. It's actually really close by. Uh, this is going to have a Cryo Gunner, a Hydro Gunner, and a Nemo Boxer, and Electro Hammer. So, the Electro Hammer, I need uh, somebody like Kaya on my team. For the Cryo Gunner, uh, it's essentially somebody like Diluc. The Hydro Gunner... Now, I keep forgetting what Hydro is weak to. But it's fine, because I... I, I have Fischl. So I only need to replace Venti for this particular challenge. And, uh... That won't be too hard to do. Because I'm going to replace him with, uh, Kaya. I think that that's the electro hammer. Yeah. No more. Yeah. Solidified. 
I will have oh, yeah. As long as I get rid of uh, this guy first, then I won't be afraid of the electro camera guy. Actually, I don't need to get rid of him. There you go. Now, the reason why I say that is because. Whoops. Why I keep mixing, switching to the wrong one? It's because as long as I keep well, I was gonna say as long as I keep him alive, none none of the other ones can spawn. But I guess they're not gonna spawn in this situation. Like those. I'm glad that they're dropping items. Stabilize. Oh, I didn't know that they could get bounced in the air like that. This isn't good. Give me my items. No! I'm gonna have to get those out with Venti. Unfortunately. Venti or, uh... What's his name? Aether. Because Aether is still... Got the, uh... Anemo element. Okay, get rid of the Hydro guy first. And then from there, I can worry about the uh, ice guy. There we go. that. Okay, there's the next path. Okay, switch to him. And I'll go to this platform right here. That should be good enough. Oh, come on. Really? Is that not, is that not close enough? The thing is going deeper and deeper. Come on. It's not lasting long enough, that's why. I wonder if I have another Anemo element. Oh, there we go. Never mind. I didn't have to worry about it that much. Let's look at the enemies for the next part of the challenge and see whether or not uh, who I need to bring. Okay, so there's a Cryo Sample. Oh, I don't have to worry about these guys as much. Uh, they're mostly ice-based, and I can use d -loop for that. So, I'm going to switch back in Venti. Get over to the fire very fast. Warm up. I wonder if they're near a healing point. If they are, then I'm going to just teleport right to that. Okay, they aren't. I would have liked to have been able to heal Diluc and Zhengli, but it's fine. Um, what? I hate how that happens sometimes. There you go. These, these things are so unreliable. Really, they should make it so that they can only go one way, so that way you can't go backwards by accident like that, but I guess they don't want to do it that way. Where could it possibly be going when it's going up like that? Okay, you're gonna have to bring me up. Thank you. Thankfully they had enough foresight to see that somebody would somehow miss... Just miss it barely. Okay, this is the area. I remember fighting in this area a long time ago. We should... Think you can get away? 
Okay. I should have used fish up this time. Getting rid of these little guys. Kind of hard. There's only 14 of them. Oh, I better get rid of this. Or I would. If I could see it, but I think I destroyed it, so never mind. I guess I did get rid of it. Like this. Let's play. Do that. I will have order. Get rid of the small fries. Oz, reveal Bring out Oz. And now there's only five left. I wonder who the last uh, four will be because they haven't appeared yet. Okay, just the big guys right there. And these two Time small guys. By royal decree. Retribution. This guy is not a big deal. There we go. I think that there's one challenge left in this region after I get rid of this guy. And unfortunately it has the boar enemy. And I don't know if it's the same boar enemy I'm thinking of, but if it is, then that could be a problem. Because I remember that thing being a, a really tough enemy. If it is, I may have to go on to other challenges uh, before I worry about that. I'm definitely going to heal before I go to wherever it is, though. Make sure there aren't any other items here. Yeah, I know. Uh, what's up with this? Oh, I guess I already solved that a long time ago. Let me see. So that's all the way over there. So if I wanted to, I could heal and then teleport here and then walk over there. Um, I'm expecting the festive fever thing to hit max probably after, not after this one, not after this challenge, but the one of the challenges from the other places. Ruined Brazier can reduce sheer fold, well, of course. So I gotta get rid of these guys Think you first. Can get away? So they were trying to destroy that when I came over here. Because they know that those are my uh, main source of reducing uh, Here we go. the cold damage. Time for takeoff. <laughs> Or not cold damage, but increasing my temperature. There we go. Why did I not make sure that this one died? I don't know. So there's gonna be three enemies that pop up here, and one of them is that stupid boar. Okay. Getting rid of these two first is a good idea, though. No matter what. Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. I forgot about its ability to use that, uh, weird attack. This force seems like it might be a little bit weaker, though. I could be wrong. I don't want to make any assumptions. Where's the... Okay, there it is. Well, crap. Okay. I just remember one of the biggest issues I had with fighting it was my inability to stay warm during the fight. And so I kept having to run back 
to uh, the one area where there was one of these things to keep you lit up. I want to stay near this because I believe that staying near this gives you an attack boost. I could be wrong about that. Oz, reveal thyself. But I think that that's what it said. And the, uh, the thing. The trail of delicacies, you know, giving the food or whatever to it. Burn. This is order. There we go. Gather. It's almost dead. So this is definitely not as hard as it was the one time in the past. But it's also possible that my equipment characters are better overall. So I have spent time like working on their uh their talents and stuff since I did Dragon Spine. Okay, you have pursued this region's trail of delicacies to its end. Please head to the next region. I'll do that in a little bit. Okay, awesome. Uh, so my characters have taken a little bit of damage, so I'll go over to a uh, healing point very fast. Once more. Well, actually, before I do that, one last sweep. I don't want to miss any items. Okay. So go over to uh, this healing point. And I already see the first one that I'm going to have to head to. I want to unlock the... Yeah, I want to reach 1,000 festive whatever's festive fever. Which should require just one more challenge to be completed. Did that really heal my characters already? Huh. No, I didn't mean to do that. Let me open up the map. Right here. So... I believe once I do this challenge... Listen, as long as you stick to your own path, it doesn't matter what mother... There we go. Uh, once I do this challenge, I'll have access to the final quest with Zheng Ling. And then, uh, I might start that in the next video. And, uh, the reason why is because in this video, I'm actually going to give the Spiral Abyss another chance. I don't think I'll be able to get very far, but I figure... Why not? Uh, I was convinced to do so. Uh, so, why does this feel like it's that enemy right there causing the problem? I thought I had Jungly out. No, uh, not Jungly, but Healer Cat. I had some of the Camp leader. So is this the camp leader that I'm fighting? Attendance will restore the HP of the camp leader. Oh, okay, so that's what the problem is. Think you can get away? I forgot about that. Okay. I will have order. By royal this guy has quite a bit of HP. Compared to normal, that is. There we go. And they'll probably tell me that I got uh, the festive spirit to 1000, right? Yeah. There we go. Now, it wants me to go to Wanmin Restaurant for the 
second part of the Moon Chase Tales. Moonlight Merriment, I should say. But I'll, like I said, I'll do that in the next video. Um, instead, let's head over here to the Spiral Abyss. I can't make any promises about how far I can get into this, but I am going to try to get deeper uh, for 10 seconds after a character uses an elemental burst. That character's normal and charge attacks will unleash a shockwave at the position of the opponent they hit at the cost of 1% of the character's HP. Okay. Dealing AoE damage. This effect will be cleared when this character leaves the field. A shockwave can be unleashed in this manner once every one second. Active characters can go down as a result of this HP loss. Uh, yeah, I don't really like the sound of that, but okay. Um, so I got as far as floor 6. Uh, so I may as well... Now the problem is, is that on floor 6... Yeah, I didn't get all the stars for this floor. Let me check this floor very fast. Yeah, so I'll worry about this one off camera. This, uh, and that's because there's only one of those, but I'm gonna do this one on camera. Uh, so for the first team, I'm gonna have, and then the, uh, next path will have, there we go. I don't know if that's a good team or not. It doesn't matter. My characters are under-equipped anyways. They're level 60 enemies. It shouldn't be a problem. In theory. Uh, character and normal charge attacks. Char uh, when character's HP is greater than 50%. Well, so this is the first chamber, first half. Now the first half of the first chamber... Uh... I've already done before. I don't know if you can start on the second chamber or not. If you can, then it's not a big deal. I need to readjust anyway to all this. There we go. Now the second half of the first chamber is gonna be this team and I honestly don't know what to expect Disappear. I should have paid attention to the fact that there would be fire whopper flowers but whatever with sword comes shadow there you go oh maybe not I just realized that that applies only to this floor okay so I can do the next floor, uh, or the next chamber, whatever it is. Um, when character HP is greater than 50%, I'll just choose that. Easier that way. So chamber two, as long as I have longer than 20, uh, 270 seconds, it should be fine. Now I know why I was basing my team compositions uh, purely off of, uh, what's it called? Off of Chamber 2. Time for takeoff. Here we go. So that's where the confusion is coming from with regards to all this. I, I didn't what even pay attention disaster. to the other chambers. This is order. Gather. Okay, you. Retribution. This guy's easy enough to get rid of. Get rid of this too. And this one. So the only team I have to worry about is the second team then. Think you can get away? They're the only ones that Yahoo! are really gonna be a problem. I will have order in all this. It's possible that Aether doesn't have any uh, any artifacts on him. I may have given all of his artifacts to one of the other characters and just forgot about it. 
I hope that's not the case. I can always check right now, can't I? If the game will let me. I guess it won't. No, cancel. Okay. So, I have to get rid of uh, these guys. And... I keep forgetting that you can charge up her attack. And I just realized that these guys are immune to... Oh no, that's not good. I should have brought a Claymore user with me. Like, Noel. At least then I could do a little bit more damage, I would think. Um, let's see. Wind, hear me. Heal everybody in my party. Wind blade. With the wind. Ah, crap. Little bit of a problem. Even though they shouldn't be. It's because they're constantly dealing damage to my party. It feels like. Now these uh, this guy over here has also been a problem too. Oh, crap. This isn't good. Okay. only have eight more, and then I should win. Unfortunately, I chose the wrong buff. Because... There we go. I'm gonna focus on this guy. It's been so long since I've used Aether that I'm... I'm not used to how he fights. A little bit uh, annoying. I should have had D Luke in this group because I had uh, what's his name in the other Jung Lee and Venti in the other group. Oh well, I'll learn from it. Uh, my mistake here. Stronger than I thought. I don't think I need to worry. Oh crap! Idea from time. And I can't. I can't uh, heal. Oh well. At least there's only one group of enemies left. I guess. Hopefully they heal your characters after. Uh, after this. Yeah, this isn't good. Uh, I'll continue on, I suppose. Who knows, I might actually be able to do this next one. I don't know if this next one is necessarily necessary to do, though. Instantly restores 25% to all HP. Uh, uh, wait. I think... That I'll do the, the HP one. Maybe that'll revive some of my characters. Hopefully, that would be nice. Time for takeoff. And if it can't, then at least I'll be able to not worry about it so much. Okay. Come on, man. Here we go. Okay, Order you. guide you. Gather. It's nothing. Your life is mine. Brace there yourself. 
Oh, this guy isn't a problem at all. Hopefully the uh, other side will be just as easy. Rise. Why did I not summon the shield? Sometimes solidify the gear table of myself. I will have order. Okay. There we go. Uh wait, when did Aether die? Aether's dead too. Okay, that's not fair, game. Whatever. I guess I'm not gonna live through this, but that's fine. Barbados, guide us. You know what? Fischl might be able to do it. If I'm very, very sneaky about this. I don't know. I just don't, I can't believe that Aether died too. And I didn't realize that he died. How did I not notice? Shadow Raven, let night fall. Nah, I have to get rid of the best mate. It's too dangerous to leave alive. There we go. I might actually be able to win with Fischl. Which is just insane. Well, this is giving me a new appreciation for her. Even if uh, these enemies are super weak by comparison. Stupid enemy keeps popping up. Causing all that dam uh, extra damage or whatever. Phantasmagoria. Okay. I just gotta hope that I can get rid of that stupid shield before it takes too much damage. There we go. Wow, Fischl. I'm truly impressed at the moment. Okay. No, I'm not going on to the next floor. Are you guys insane? So that should have given me all of those, uh, those things. Let me just see very fast. Yeah, I can claim the, all of those claim rewards. And so I've claimed all of those, all of those. Now I finally have access to the seventh floor, uh, but I'm not gonna worry about that. That that was not quite, I, I don't think I can go any further than that without getting my characters properly geared up because that was more annoying than I thought it would be. You know what? I could try it, though. Okay, crit hits will generate elemental particles and orbs. Can only occur once every 15 seconds. Crit damage dealt by all party members increased by 120. Okay. I think that that'll balance everything out. Okay, let's start. I don't know if that's going to work out well or not. I hope it does. I should have probably put Venti in the first group. Now, the only reason why I say that is because I think there's a lot more enemies that appear in the first groups. And Venti excels at that kind of thing, but... Character element of burst damage, 20%. Uh, character defense. 
I think I'll do the character defense one. I don't want my characters dying, and I didn't include a character that can heal in this group. So... Or at least I don't think I did. Sucrose might be able to heal, I don't remember. Okay. Oh, I thought this... Okay, they're both ice guys. Level 65? It isn't time for a break here. Stand clear. Wind blade. Whatever. Time for kind of my own fault. Oh no. My duty. There we go. Now I'm anticipating the next enemy. Chris. That's another ice guy. This quickly. I hate these ice guys. Very annoying. Crap. Hopefully they give me an option to heal between this one and the next one. I'll, I'll definitely choose that. Yeah, I can't use uh, healing items in the, in the fire like this. I'm, I'm dumb. I don't know why I didn't think to... Oh, so sorry. Cool it. There we go. I don't know why I didn't think to include people that could heal in this group. Yeah, just one person is all it would have taken. Oh well. I just realized I didn't include a uh, Claymore user in this group either. Oh well, hopefully it won't be a problem. Okay, yeah, she isn't really a cook for this either. No surprise there. Stabilize. And I didn't include the ice, uh, fire person. Oh wait, yeah, I did. Come on. Get rid of this. Thank you. This is order. Solidify. Why would I do that? I don't know. I'm referring to switching over to Barbara in that situation. Now, in this situation, it's understandable. unfortunate fault. Okay, man. I was hoping that Venti would uh, deal, deal a lot of damage, but obviously can't. Whatever. Let's play! Think you can get away? No! Okay. I will. Oh wait, have this order. is the end of the the battle. There we go. I didn't get the first one. Darn it. Or not the first. Or the last one. It's fine. Uh, I'll continue. I knew that I would be under equipped for this, but I decided to give it a try anyways. I'll restore everybody's HP. And I and I can't heal even outside of battle here. Okay. Ah, uh, whatever. There's only five of them. And freshness preserved. I must select myself. There we 
go. That wasn't too bad. I may have a problem in this fight. Wait, no, never mind. It's not a big problem. It isn't the kind of problem I thought I might have. There you go. There's only this guy left. Come on, man. Stop that. Stop that already. Thank you. That the attack of the, their attacks last way too long when they start doing that. Animal test 6308. Why did I do that? I don't know. I keep I'm used to being able to switch between my characters and other parties, but it's not working out here as well as I'd hoped. Um I can't switch to uh Chen Li before I start this fight, huh? Here we go. Time there for takeoff. And now that I've done that. My only real damage dealer in the party is Gun Lee. Order guide you. Which isn't terrible. Stabilize. I mean he's not a bad damage dealer. Think you can get away? Brace yourself. It's just that Oh. I did not mean to exit. Why did they make the the cancel button, the exit button there. And why don't they ask you to confirm? Let me make sure. Did I lose everything? Oh, wait, oh, okay. They ask you if you want to continue. Character elemental burst damage, 20%. Or heal everybody's HP. I'll heal everybody's HP. Since I had no way of really canceling at that point. Put your back into it. Okay, is that a water guy? Yeah, I think that is. Get frostbite. Absorption test. Enhanced animal module 75. Crap. Retribution. Where did I go? Everywhere. That's where you went wrong. Everywhere. Absorption test. Stand clear. I, I have no chance of winning now. I may as well quit. Dodge this. Oh, now I really have no chance of winning now. Yeah, I'm gonna leave. I could have selected the uh, retry option. Okay, let let me try it again then. I apologize for the craziness of this. I mean, I really am not properly geared at all. Uh, let's go ahead and try. Oh, well, actually, no. I got. I've got to heal because they 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 save the amount of HP, the uh, amount of damage that you've taken. That's why. All that matters. Okay, if I can get rid of this this guy first, then everything else will probably fall. Because this was the guy that was causing me the most issues. There we go. Then this guy. Followed by this guy. Freeze. There we go. Wow, that went a lot more smoothly once I uh, had time to think about it. Okay. Now let's go ahead and get rid of these guys. Unfortunately, I don't have an ice person on my team this time, so I need to get rid of this. This guy first. This is order. This hammer guy. Stabilize. There we go. This is 
Seem like everything changed all of a sudden. I I'm leaving now, but it's like all of a sudden I go from struggling to just completely destroying everything. It actually felt normal for once. Whatever. I'm not gonna do the eighth floor, but I am going to claim my prizes for uh, this. So chamber one, unfortunately for the seventh floor and chamber uh, one for the fifth floor are the only ones that I'm missing as far as that's concerned. And then, yeah, you've got this right here. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna worry about that stuff. So, uh, Thank you very much for watching. The next time I play, I will uh, most likely be finishing up the timed event. Well, I'm going to try to finish up as much of the timed event as I can. Or at least uh, the Moon Chase or uh, Moonlight Merriment quest, which, by the way, I should really navigate over towards uh, just because. So it's all the way down there in town. They wanted me to go to one min restaurant, I think. So, uh, yeah, thanks again. See you next time. And bye bye.